Gabe, uh, just how good it feel to come back uh, and really kind of, uh, you know, put them down the way they needed to be after that loss last week? Um, you know, I mean, it felt good. You know, we're the same team we were before we lost the pit. I mean, we just come out every single week. This week of practice was a great week of practice. Um, came and attacked every single day, and, um, you know, that's the result. Gabe, what's it mean to, to, to get off to a, a great start in the conference? I mean, that is your number one goal, I would assume. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, it feels good. You know, first first game of conference play, um, you know, the just because we, 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 we lose one in the regular season, you know, there's still, you know, time when it comes to the division play and stuff like that. So I'm happy we were able to get our first conference win. Gabe, you had the big, long 73-yard 70, catch. What did you see on that play, and, and what kind of stood out to you about it? Um, all I know is when I caught the ball, I thought of, you know, all the other guys like Jerry Judy, C.D. Lamb, um, Henry Ross, you know, those guys that are, you know, making big plays, making plays like that. I mean, C.D. Lamb just had a big 70-something yarder today, and that's literally what was going through my head as soon as I caught the ball. That I, had to, I had to do the same thing those guys are doing. Gabe, can you kind of uh, go a little bit more into that? Um, you know, you averaging about 100 yards a game and kind of been locked in and your mm -hmm. matchups and winning your matchups. Can you just talk about the individual groove you're in to kind of help fuel the offense and how it's going? Well, I just know I have a lot of um, guys compete uh, compete with around the country. Um, you know, I want I want to um, be the best out there. Um, yeah, I had 100 and whatever yards for three touchdowns, but I could have had a fourth one um, in the red zone. That was a back shoulder throw that I, that I didn't make, and um, you know, just got to work on that this week and try to you know get in rhythm with Dylan when it comes to those type of throws and being able to make those plays. You guys were really down last week. What does a game like this do for your confidence? Uh, I don't think last week even changed our confidence whatsoever. Like I said, we come every single week, attack the same way we do. Um, we're competitors. You know, we love to win, uh, especially for each other. So I feel like we just came out, you know, every single week like we've been doing for the past two years. Um, like I said, this UCF team is no different just because, you know, we had that one loss. Gabe, was, was that your grandfather in the punt competition? Yeah, And did yeah. you get to celebrate a touchdown with him? Yeah, I did, yeah. I was what was that to, like? It was awesome. I know, I know it made him happy. He was probably back there crying or something. But, um, <laughs> you know, all, that, all he does, he, you know, he loves football. That's all he watches every single day. And just to see, you know, his, his grandson doing something like that is special. Gabe, how great was it to see a DJ back on the field again to, to actually see performance? It was great. I love seeing DJ come back out there. You know, DJ's still the same guy he was last year. Um, he can some, come in and make plays whenever we need him to be. So, I'm, you know, I'm really happy he got to step in and uh, make some plays. Gabriel, with, re with regard to the approach and the mentality going into this game, um, did you notice maybe a difference between going into this game and, you know, going into the last game? Again, I mean, uh, I can't say this enough that this team, you know, came in no different. We came in every single week how we always do, be prepared the same way. Um, we're going to continue to be hungry no matter how many wins we have or how many times we lose. Um, you know, we're going to stick together, keep pushing out through the weeks, and, you know, keep trying to get a, a win. Gabe, the first five offensive touchdown drives took a total of less than four minutes. Mm -hmm. And so I know this UCF fast is said a lot, but when you score five offensive touchdowns in three minutes, 51 seconds, what do you say? I mean, that's what I expect out of us. You know, that's what we expect out of each other, to um, execute plays as fast as we can and most little, little time. So... Um, Something like that, you know, I'm not surprised that we did something like that. That's what we're built for. That's what we work for every single day.